Well, what's up guys, it's CPK here, standing in my newly finished room thing. Don't really know what room this is going to be, but I finished it, and it is done. And, uh, yes, I've been doing little bits for my house. So yeah, uh, what's up guys, this is episode 3, I think. Oh god, I don't even know what episode it is. I think it's episode 3 of the Minecraft project with me. And look, I did some stairs at the side of my house so I can get on the roof. And look how cool shaped this building is. Hold on, hold on. But look at that so innovative and unique uh, I don't actually know how that happened, it was just complete chance that I built it like that <laughs> so uh, yeah guys, what soup what soup is happening um, I'm just gonna go randomly running around and exploring whilst I talk about something pretty serious um, now I don't know whether you guys, I don't know what your guys musical tastes are but if it wasn't apparent already based on like my a map to remember and stuff and you know my general appearance most people will judge me on my appearance um i'm into heavier music sort of like hardcore post hardcore metalcore stuff like that like heavy music that involves screaming and angry teenager music you know um so yeah and recently a guy named mitch lucker who was the lead vocalist of a band called suicide silence uh passed away from a motorbike crash and you know this is just basically a resting sort of like well not a rest in peace video because you know I just want to talk about the death of him and whatnot and uh, see if anyone else has any opinions on stuff like this. Now, for like fans of the music, obviously this is like horrible. This is like a big big deal for those people because you know he's like the lead vocalist of a ridiculously huge metal band. Like the actual genre I believe is deathcore, but. I don't really follow that music, that genre at all. Um, but, like, the thing is, I mean, there's a lot of people being, like, ridiculously disrespectful. Like, people who don't listen to the music. Like, there's actually a page on Twitter, uh, which is a One Direction fan page. And they're posting things like, oh, did Mitch Lucker cut his wrists and that's why he's dead? And did Mitch Lucker ever win four VMAs in one go and it's like that's why one direction are better and it's the most ridiculous thing i've ever seen like the guy has died literally within the past 48 hours and people are there like giving him shit there's like a video on the internet now of his candlelight vigil that like his family set up and his daughter's there and his daughter's like four years old and she doesn't understand what's going on and his wife's there and all his friends are there and there's fans of the band there and it's just like the nicest thing ever. It actually like had me close to tears. And I'm not even bothered to admit that. I don't really... I'd never like followed the band. I don't like the band so much. But still, it's a respect thing. Like he did massive things for a lot of people. And if people are going to disrespect someone's death, I think that's absolutely disgusting. Like I genuinely hate it so much. So... Yeah, just, you know, with that, with that being said, you know, it's kind of just, you know, rest in peace to that guy, to Mitch Locker. Um, not sure what's going to happen with the band now. I'm not sure if they'll be able to continue because, you know, he was kind of like the unique selling point of the band. Um, but yeah, enough doom and gloom stuff. Uh, back to this Movember stuff. I've done nothing this episode. I'm so sorry. I actually don't know what I'm doing. I'm just running around. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to stand here and talk for the next, like, minute or so. This is going to be the end of the video in a second, guys. So, um, yeah, as for this Movember thing, it's going pretty well. Me, Yami Mash, and Mr. Yo-Yo Muffin have made, like, a little team, and you can still donate to us all, and we'd massively appreciate it if you guys could donate. And, um, yeah, it's, I'm going to leave a link in the description. We've currently raised, like, nearly £5 or something. I know it's nothing, but it's just nice to know that we're going to get money to give to other people, which is definitely what we want to do. And it's all to raise awareness of prostate cancer and testicular cancer. So if you guys are interested in donating, I'd definitely appreciate it. Any amount at all. It can be a minimum of a pound or a dollar, and that's really cheap. So if you guys can have that to spare, just, you know, throw it that way. That's a really cool glitch. Look at my, look at my zoom at your face. Ugh. But yeah, guys, uh, thanks for watching the episode, and make sure to stay tuned for the next episode, which will actually have a point and a meaning. <laughs> so thanks for watching, and make sure to stay tuned for the next one, guys. Thanks, bye.